Footnotes from the Life Application Study Bible. Although we start out with good intentions, sometimes our faith falters. This doesn't necessarily mean we have failed. When Peter's faith faltered, he reached out to Jesus, the only one who could help. He was afraid, but he still cried out to Jesus. When fear piles up against you in waves, causing you to doubt whether Jesus is near or willing to help you, remember that he is always with you and is the only one who knows how to help you. Genesaret was located on the west side of the Sea of Galilee in a fertile, well-watered area. The people recognized Jesus as a great healer, but how many understood who he truly was? They came to Jesus for physical healing, but did they come for spiritual healing, which they needed even more? They came to make their lives better on earth, but did they come seeking eternal life? People may follow Jesus to learn valuable lessons from his life, or in hopes of finding relief from pain or stress. But we miss Jesus' central message if we seek him only to heal our bodies, not our souls. If we look to him for help only in this life, rather than for his eternal plan for us, when we connect with the real heart of Jesus Christ, we experience how he can truly change our lives. Jewish men wore tassels in the lower edges according to God's command. By Jesus' day, elaborate versions of these tassels were seen as of their cloak's sign of holiness. It was natural that people seeking healing would reach out and touch the tassels of Jesus' cloak. But as one sick woman learned, healing came when she reached out in faith, not from any power in Jesus' clothing, 